Hello, my name is Sekhet, and uh, welcome to episode 20 of Journey of Sorcerer. I want to thank everybody who's been watching. I've been seeing a lot of people, uh, a <laughs> comparative lot of people to usually my videos, uh, checking it out. So, uh, hello. Thank you very much. I'm going to try something first. I, I want to work on the house a little bit today. And I'm going to try something that I don't know if it's going to work. Now, item frames are entities, which means they should be able to share the, uh, the same space as a block. Where's my axe? There it is. And I was going to try to do something with some shelving, but it's, uh, it's very finicky. Okay, so that, uh, sort of works. Not really. That was worth a shot. And I know I always do this, but I do it because I like the way it looks. Uh, I'm going to put some end rods and some glass to make ourselves some lamps here and there. Okay, bedroom's starting to look like something. We're just going to put a couch down over here. Yeah. The real question is, what are we going to do with this room? It's just kind of like space with a clock. Let's think about it. Alright, we're going to make another piece of furniture over here. Put a barrel in. So change my armor. Um, we're going to hang up the skeleton armor for now. I've got the full set of utopian armor now. This is going to give us uh, a total of plus 30% to the uh, experience we gain in these skills from Advent of Ascension. And uh, we're going to see how much better we do with the extraction. Okay, so we leveled up very quickly. We've only got uh, five obsidians so far, so we've only got five operations. Okay, we finally got to 20. Um, two stacks plus 20 worth of uh, lava buckets to get there, so... It's not a whole lot faster, but I'm glad that we... Hello! Here, here. Glad that we have it. Yeah, that was exciting. I didn't have uh, my headset on. <laughs> There's one more thing we should be able to catch here. I guess we'll, uh, we'll find out what it is. Now, I wanted to check out the banners that this guy has. I don't know if he uh, gets anything new when he levels. I don't think so. I don't actually know anything about these, so... Huh. Let him level one more time. There you go. Uh -huh. An ancient banner. And with a lot of them, you can make a gilded ancient banner. Okay. Okay, right. check these things out. Oh no, uh... They're awful bright. <laughs> Uh, cool. Yeah, they look alright. Let's put a bunch of them around. We can also use these rooms as banner patterns. You just uh, craft them with a piece of paper. Uh, let's go ahead and See what we can do here. We'll do the spark down the middle. 
and border, right? Yeah. There's our transcribe flag, and let's see if we can. Can we put color in? Oh. Well, that's weird. Comes out looking like that. I mean, that can't be right, right? Let's see. Did that work? Nah. Oh well. We'll figure it out. Let's try a single color banner. How oh, this comes out. No? We're in the loom, maybe? Yeah. I don't think that's working. Set up decorating for now. Next thing I want is a ring from Batania. So we're gonna make some mana steel just by throwing iron ingots in there. And then we're gonna take a little bit of glass. And I think it's just a glass. Uh, just a regular glass. And we'll need an iron and a gold also, right? And this will do uh, just like you'd expect. It's, uh, it's a magnet. There's the lens and the ring. Because I've noticed that uh, I'm missing, I, I'm missing out on a lot of the little particles that give you a uh, enervation. And what's the other one? Um, I guess butchery, I think. And I don't want to miss out on those. The way it works is like, uh, you know, throw this thing over here. Yeah, there it is. It takes a second with items you've thrown down. And now, what we're going to do is hunt for keepers. Uh, to get to uh, the next dimension, I want to check out Creeponia. What we have to do is uh, survive a creeper blast with prime TNT nearby. So we're going to see if we can't find ourselves a uh, creeper out here. See if we can manage this. Okay, of course there's like three of them. What is this character? Oh, that's a creeper with a hat. That's perfect. Come on. All right. One Creeponia realm stone. The magnet does not work on the particles. <laughs> Works on everything else, um, but it doesn't work on this. Oh, now we know. Alright. Oh my. Land of Creepers. Here we go. A large creeper forest. Alright, let's go ahead and make a waypoint, I guess. Um, there we go. Starting to get a lot of portals here. Alright, I don't see anything immediately interesting on the map. You see what are probably creepers? That's a flying creeper? It's an undead creeper. Winged creeper. Huh. 
Alright. Well, I guess we'll just proceed carefully along. I wonder what this wood's like. Oh, kind of gray. Just a regular creeper. Close everything. What's this? Cree purple. Small, that's for sure. <laughs> I have to keep a very close eye out. There's another one. I think I better look at it. Okay, so it's got head. What is it? Like, just, it doesn't seem to want to move up on me. What all are we, okay, we're getting coins and we're getting gunpowder. Another one of these winged creepers. Lagged out. There we go. Alright. Doesn't seem so bad. I thought it was going to be a lot worse than this. Just uh, go off in this direction, I guess. Try not to step on any creepers. What's this? Creeper cow? Hostile? I don't think it's hostile. Here. What's this? See that? Oh, it's a shrine. Let's, uh... I'm doing a bang-up job here. Oh, it's not a shrine. We got a, okay, we got a couple of things going on here. We've got an explosives expert. Grenades? <laughs> Neat. We'll mark this guy. Ah, we don't need to mark him. He's cool. But what's this? Let's see. Creep altar. I'll bet this is where uh, we summon a boss. So this we will mark. Alright, moving on. Bone Creeper? They don't really seem to move around that much. Like the regular Creeper was moving. These other guys are just sitting here. I'm sure we won't be that lucky with the boss. Okay, this one moves. And explodes. Oh, oh my. Looking for a way underground. I think it's, uh... Oh, hello! Okay, so I can get a creepy banner from you. Oh, there's two of you. Do you sell the exact same thing? How about you, buddy? Yeah, okay. I'm not sure I have the soul banner. But I know I have energy creation and blood. Alright, we're almost back at the port, right? Is that it? Yeah. Let's, uh... I 
just get ready to start digging down, huh? Okay, we found our first door. I don't know if it's going to explode or... Okay, so that gives you a gem, huh? That's part of what we need to make the great blade. And explosive gems, and part of what we need to make a mercurial leg. Alright. Okay, there's no shortage of this stuff. I've mined just a little bit. We've also got these creep crystals. Uh, there are two ores at this level, and there's one more at a lower level where I think there's a different type of stone. Just dig out a little bit and get ourselves some of this and go on down. Okay, let's try this creep crystal. Okay, it didn't blow up. I keep expecting the ore to blow up. <laughs> I think we're just smashing it. Hmm. We do have a silk touch axe. There we go. What do you do with it? Nothing. Okay, this is the other kind of stone. <laughs> More of this crystal. And we found a cave. Starting to wonder. Alright. See what we'll find. There's definitely something wrong with most of these mobs. They just don't move. Okay, here's... Or we were looking for... Ornamite! How much of this are we gonna need? It took a long time. Okay, so we make tools. We need three to make an explosive gem. And we need three more for, uh... For this business. Okay. See if we can find a little bit more. And maybe start to... Uh, maybe on our way out of here. Okay, let's see what we can do, do with this stuff. There's a great plate. There's that. Okay, it's this stuff. So we'll need a total of one, two, we'll need five unstable gunpowder. How much do we have? Four. I might go back and uh, just kill some creepers. Alright, now we're going to make some fancy armor. Let's start with uh, all the frames. All right. There's the pants. And there's other stuff we can make with this. There's uh oh my. That's a that's a serious sniper rifle. There's a shotgun. But we don't have uh access to confetti yet or darkly powder or power cores. We do need to, we'll need to get some padded cloth real quick. Burka hide? Let's get some padded cloth. Just two torn cloth, right? Right, two torn cloth and wool. Where'd it go? Back over here. Now we got the pants and the boots. And the helmet. Now what this does, taking explosive damage will give us resistance. And that's uh, pretty cool. Let's 
Yeah, we don't have a lot of this other stuff yet, but we'll get it. All right. Let's see how it looks. Nice. All right, so we checked out Peponia. I guess uh, the next thing we're going to have to do is start uh, thinking about the bosses there, but that's going to have to wait until the next episode. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.